Good morning, everybody. Uh, well, good afternoon or good day, whatever it is. It's it's 12 o'clock, so um, it's noon. I uh, appreciate everybody joining the stream today. It is the first stream of uh, the new year. It is uh, January 1st, 2021, and uh, we are going to play some old school magic. But uh, while I got you here, please uh, don't forget to follow, and you can join me each and every Tuesday at 8 p.m. Eastern for my regularly scheduled stream. I play three rounds of Old School Magic with the Northern Paladins as part of the Tuesday Night Gauntlet. So make sure you follow, turn on those notifications so that you know when I go live. Uh, Derby Hype, how you doing, Blazer? Man, you just don't ever go to sleep, do you? Um, the rest of my uh, Batch 1 Derby schedule is as follows. Tomorrow at 3 p.m. Eastern. And Sunday morning at 10 a.m. Eastern. So uh, we've got uh, um, got a couple more derby matches uh, coming up. And we are going to go over to my opponent. So uh, my opponent today is Eric Henriksen. Um, Eric, welcome to the stream. And thank you for uh, allowing me to uh, stream these matches. <clears throat> Thanks. Uh, happy to be here. All right. <clears throat> so. uh, happy New Year to everybody in chat. Thank you. Uh, Blazer84 uh, says, your opponent is in our group in Norway, so have to cheer for him tonight. That's fine. Um, <laughs> so, uh, uh, Eric, one thing that happens on stream quite frequently is my uh, my uh, viewers will root for my opponents. I, I fully encourage them to do so. Um, it used to be that I would have sound alerts set up where they could actually tell me that I suck. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, um, yeah, so you might uh, get uh, a decent following in our, uh, um, in our uh, game today by uh, uh, the, the viewers who are in the uh, in the chat um you want to take uh even or odd uh i'll pick odds odds it is a two it is even so i will uh i will play first and yep. uh we got uh, one two three uh you can put uh two on top of three two on top of three and put both um, on top of one yeah okay um, and you can do the same. All right. Good luck, sir. Good luck. <clears throat> yeah, so Blazer was in my stream last night uh, watching, um, and uh, up until uh, the bitter end. So uh, I don't know. Uh, Blazer just apparently never sleeps, I guess. So. Uh, that's true. Mm -hmm. um, I'll <laughs> keep this one. Hmm. Yeah, I'll keep as well. All right. Um, I will play library and I'll say go. Uh, 
I'll play uh, Underworld Dreams and pass. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Underground C. Uh, so you might have tipped uh, your hand as to what uh, is in there because you said Underworld Dreams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven oh. cards. <laughs> I'm going to tap and draw. Brings me up to eight. <clears throat> and I will, uh, let's see. I'm going to go with a City of Brass. I'll tap it for one down to 19 um, and bring out a Birds of Paradise and I'll say go. Go mm, for Play a city um, pass. All right, un untap. Draw one, two, three, four, five, six, seven cards. So I will tap and draw, and I will. Uh, so I've got eight. I will play a tundra, and I'll tap that for a green for an Argothian Pixies. Six cards Perfect. left. Go ahead. Swamp. Mm -hmm. Rock ritual. Yeah. And I'll take one. Put you at 19 as well. Yeah. Sing your vampire. Sing Outstanding. And pulse. Okay. Untap. One, two, three, four, five, six cards. Draw for turn up to seven. Draw with a library to go up to eight. <clears throat> um, I will cast a Swords to Plowshares on your vampire. Sure. Brings you to 23. I will attack you for two. Bring you down to 21. Yeah. Seven. Um, then uh, I'm going to... Um, I will play my own Underground C, and I will cast a Demonic Tutor. Uh, sure. <clears throat> Get that thing there. And then <clears throat> get a couple more shuffles. Cut. I will take a point for a blue. I'm at 18. And I will cast Ancestral Recall targeting myself. Yep. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. We have eight cards. I will play a Mock Sapphire and I will say go. Draw for dark. Twenty. Yep. Okay, Here's dreams. the underworld dreams. Okay. Pause. Alright. Uh, untap. Upkeep. Seven cards. Draw for turn and take a point. I'm at 17. I will play a Mistress Factory. I will uh, tap the library and draw and take a point. Um, I will attack you for two. It didn't. Bring you down to 18. Um... <clears throat> I will, uh, let's see, I will play a Serendib Afrit. Yep. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then I will, that's it. I'll say go. Roll.
uh, sync all on your uh, library. Sure. <laughs> Take one. Uh, spirit link on your Efreet. Spirit link on the Efreet. Okay. So you are currently at 17, correct? Yep. Okay. Uh, yeah, that resolves. And I'll pulse. Okay. Run tap. Upkeep. I take one and you gain one. So I'm at 15 and you are at 18. Yep. I will draw and take a point. So I'm at 14. Um, I will play a Tundra. I will activate my factory and I'll attack you for four. Yeah, down to 14. Okay. And then uh, I will take a point down to 13 to cast a Sarah Angel. Sure. And I will say go. Roll. Play a jet. Yep. Um, I, I think I missed my point from yeah, I missed my point from my underground from the underworld dreams. So I'm at twelve. Oh. It was so tied yeah. up with, with the uh, the dib that I didn't do the point from the underworld dreams. Yeah, I missed <clears> it. <throat> so um let's see. I'm at fourteen. Um, I'll pause there. Okay. Untap. Uh, upkeep. I take one down to 11, and you gain one up to 15. I will draw and go down to 10. <clears throat> I will play another Tundra. Mm -hmm. um, I am going to... Cast a disenchant on your spirit link. Uh, sure. So your spirit link goes away. Um, <clears throat> um, I'm going to cast uh, regrowth on the disenchant. Uh, yep. And then I will uh, disenchant the Underworld Dreams. Yep. I will take a point uh, from the city to activate my factory. And I will attack for 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Yep, I'll take one from city for white. Oh. And disenchant the factory. Okay. All right, so take nine. Yeah. Um, and then you took one from that, so you're at five now. Yeah. Um, go ahead. <clears throat> yeah, that won't do it. Okay. <clears throat> Whew.
library is uh, hard to beat yeah <laughs> yeah it was I was uh, grinding out a lot of card advantage on that <clears throat> appreciate everybody who is in the stream today uh, we have just finished game number one we are going into game number two uh, my opponent, Eric, will be uh, on the play, I assume. Most people choose to be on That's the play. That's correct. <clears throat> so, let's uh, hope for some uh, some more good magic. That was back and forth quite a bit, um, but uh, I was able to, to get over the top right at the end there. Yeah, it was, uh, it was too many creatures. Yeah. Um, but, well, uh, yeah. I was kind of fearing a balance, but I, I figured that um, it was either go for uh, go for it and make you have the balance, or uh, I was probably gonna uh, not win because I was taking so much damage. So. Yeah, taking uh, taking two or three damage uh, on my turn from uh, you know with uh, the Dib and the Underworld and my City of Brass, it was just. Uh, <laughs> um, I had to do something. It was uh, go big or go home, right? Yeah, I agree. Mm -hmm. on top of one and on top of three okay um and uh put uh uh two on top the other the other two i don't care yeah okay all right good luck sir good luck Beautiful looking hands with no lands. <laughs> <laughs> they usually are with no lands. <laughs> I'll just let the cat out this climbing at my feet. <laughs> You can go uh, one on top of three and on top of two. Okay. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm going to ship this one back, too. Oh. <clears throat> it yeah, was... Uh, that one was a one lander. And if the one land wasn't a mistress factory it, um and it actually produced blue then <laughs> i would have kept it because i had the ancestral you know so i mean uh, having a one lander with uh um ancestral uh, being able to cast ancestral isn't a bad thing but uh um having a, a one lander with uh, just uh, mistress factory isn't the greatest so yeah <laughs>
three, two, one. Yeah, roll three to one. Three to one. I'll do this one. I'll put these two back. Yeah. Uh, I will city and sapphire and poster. Okay. Draw. I will I'll play a factory and I'll say go. Also play a factory and say go. Draw. Tundra, go ahead. <clears throat> um, play ancestral myself. Yeah. Three cards. Planes yep. and go. Draw. Uh, tropical islands. Argothian pixies. Sure. Go ahead. Um, how many cards do you have in your hand? One, two, three, four. The dreaded question in old school magic. How many cards <laughs> are in your hand? Yeah. I'll tap the city for a black. Um, cast the mind twist for three. Okay. All right. Which one do I get to keep? Here's one. Here's four. Uh, you can keep um, number three. Number three. Good one. Uh, disenchant, regrowth, and city of brass. Okay. Uh, I'll play a maze and pause. Alright, untap. Draw. I will activate my factory and I'll attack with both of these guys. Okay, I'll maze your pixies. Okay. So take two. Yeah, 17. 17. And uh, you can go. I'll play a scrub lamp. Mm -hmm. And um, take one. Sink all your uh, thunder. Okay. And pause. Uh, untap. Draw. Play a tundra off the top. <laughs> <laughs> uh, attack with the pixies. Um. Maze. Okay. Go ahead. Uh, Death Faust in uh, chat wants to see my deck list. Uh, when it comes to the Derby, uh, when it comes to the more competitive events, um, I don't actually reveal my deck list um, until uh, later on. So uh, you're not going to see the deck list for another couple of weeks. Sorry. <laughs> Go after. Take one. And um, sink all your tundra. Okay. And I'll pause. And how many cards do you have? I have five. Okay. I will draw. I will play an underground C. Mm -hmm. And I will attack for two. Uh, mace. Okay. Go ahead. Uh, 
Death Faust, uh, it's, uh, would you play Old School Zoo? Um, I did, I did play Old School Zoo actually on uh, my uh, New Year's Eve stream last night uh, a couple of different times. Um, I have, uh, I have played it uh, a couple of times uh, on stream and uh, it has its uh, pluses and its minuses, just like every deck does. You gonna blow up a land again? Yeah, I played this one. Yeah. And uh, I'll play Chaos Orb. Okay. Um, and I will uh, activate it on your uh, on Ground C. Sure. I use the mace. Okay. <clears throat> oh! Ooh. Missed. <laughs> I think you need to start a little closer. You were well more than a foot above the table. <laughs> yeah, I think so. <laughs> All set? Um, I'll pause. All right. Draw. Uh, uh, attack with the pixies. Uh, miss. Okay. Go ahead. Take one. Dreams. Uh, mana dream. Sure. Death file says you may top eight in an old school event with Zoo never playing the format at your LGS. Yeah, congrats, man. Um, I played uh, well, the very first time I played old school. It was a red, white, and blue deck with uh, Serendibs and Lions and uh, um, Sarah Angels and a bunch of a burn. Um, so that's what got me hooked on the format. Uh, you're all set, Eric. Yeah, pause. All right, how many cards do you have in your hand? Four. Four, okay. Um, attack with the Pixies. Nice. Go ahead. <clears throat> uh, chat, uh, uh, what uh, you, you guys missed was Eric and I had a conversation before the stream started. He's fairly new to old school magic, so... Uh, um, he, he doesn't have the reps in when it comes to Chaos Orb. <laughs> well, that's the hardest part of old school. <laughs> it, it is. It, 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 it is. Like, you can you can uh, build the, the worst deck in the world and nobody's going to care, but uh, people judge you based on your Chaos Orb flips. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'll play uh, Factory. Yep. And I'll... Uh... <clears throat> Animate this one. Okay. Yeah. And that's uh, no way. <laughs> I didn't look at your screen. I forgot that I missed your pixies. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, it's your turn. Okay. Draw. I'll play a pearl. Yep. Um. I'm going to say go. The jig is up now. I'm not going to attack the <laughs> pixies just in case. I'm not going to send it in the pixies for you to take two so that I take a bunch more. <clears throat> Let's see. Um, I'm a better flipper, apparently, when I am... Uh, uh, when I've been drinking, because uh, I made quite a few flips last night on stream. <laughs> yeah, maybe more rela relaxed. <laughs> uh, yeah, Bruins545 uh, five, five in chat says, um, I know a lot of new old school players who've never even flipped a Chaos Orb, so miss that with pride. Uh, that was me. Um, my first old school deck, I didn't put uh, a Chaos Orb in there, even though we were allowed proxies, because I'd never flipped a Chaos Orb, so... <clears throat> Uh, but, uh, that, I, I, I mean, I'm not happy with it, but it resolves. And I'll pulse. All right. Draw. We're going to see. How do you like it? I'm going to put a spirit link on your creature. Sure. And I will say go. Um, I will turn. I'll take 
one and uh, disenchant your speed leak. Okay, fine. So you're at. F I must have missed one. Okay, so you're at 13. Yeah, I'm at uh, go. Okay. Take. I'll take it. I'm at 16. Play a swamp and post it. Right. Untap. Draw. Uh, play a Serendip of Freight. Sure. And. Uh, I will say go. <clears throat> uh, I will take. I'll take it. I'm at twelve. Play hypnotic. Sure. And pass. Untap. How many cards do you have? Three cards. Three. Okay. Draw. Oh, I'm sorry. I take a point on my upkeep from the Serendip. I'm at 11. Um. See what happens. I'm gonna attack with both. <clears throat> yeah. I'll maze the pixies. Okay. Um Take damage from the fleet. Okay, put you on the turn. Um, I'm going to play a Birds of Paradise. Sure. And I will put a Spirit Link on your vampire. Yep. And. Uh, Uh, you can go. You have two cards? Yeah. Two cards, yep. I'll attack with the specter. Uh, I'll block with the birds. Yep. The factory. Okay, all the factories going on over there. Yeah. <laughs> um, then I'll pass up. Alright, untap. Upkeep, I take a point, I'm down to 10. I'll draw. Oh. And you have how many cards? Three cards. Three? I don't like that. Um, twister for three. Or mind twist you for three, sorry. Okay, I'll... Um, I'll... Um, play Divine Offering on the Pearl. On the Pearl, sure. And I'll discard Time Twister and Divine Offering. Okay. Um, I will play a Savannah, and I will say go. <clears throat> All right. Uh, go. Right, untap. Upkeep, I take a point. I'm at nine. Draw. Um, go ahead. 
Bon. Play a sinkhole on your um Savannah? Savannah? Sure. Yep. Um plus I will draw. Um Demonic Tutor. Sure. Around my point again. I'm sorry, I'm at eight. Yeah. I'm getting real bad at that. Special myself. Sure. One, two, three. Um, I'm going to play a tropical island, mox jet, and a lotus. Yep. And I'm going to say go. Two cards in hand. Okay. Hmm. Oh, boss. Right, untap. Upkeep, I go to seven. Draw. I will play a not very useful library into yeah. a soul ring. Yeah. Well, some and I will say go. Go. Underground, underground C. And pause. Untap. Upkeep, I take a point. I'm at six. Draw. Uh, go ahead. Got uh, some real interesting ma magic going on here. End of turn. I'll play and disenchant on your spirit link. Disenchant on the spirit link, sure. And go. <clears throat> I'll attack. Uh, I'll block. Sure. Put a counter on you, dude. That's not often. <laughs> mm -hmm. um... I've had quite a weird draw given. Uh that mulligan to five so i did actually put two lands on the bottom um i put uh, two cities of brass on the bottom of my deck <laughs> can't show them wow. to you now because i've already shuffled because of the tutor but uh yeah it was uh um it was a little odd but I'll pulse. i don't have to take damage on my upkeep which is good but uh, i'm pretty much dead yep all right, let us go to the next game. Wow, that's uh, that was a weird game. Yeah, it was. I I I'm not sure I had the last draw myself because uh, but yeah, you had the worst. <laughs>
Well, you all tuned in for a, a good one. I mean, good as in at least we're going to game three. I don't know if it was good as in the content is good. Because uh, uh, we both really didn't do a hell heck of a lot that game. But uh, let's uh, do a good shuffle. I'm going to do a pile shuffle too. Cause let's uh, see what we can do about uh, breaking up some of the, some of the cards that uh, were clumped together. Said at least uh, the game took longer than the, the shuffling. Bruins, thank you very much. Oh, wow. Gifted uh, tier one sub. Thank you very much for that. Uh, Bruins, um, if you want to uh, uh, send me a DM with your um, address, um, I will gladly send you um, send you out uh, an old school magic card. And if you do want it signed by me, I will sign it as well. Uh, appreciate that. That's what I do when people give subs to my... Uh, channel. Uh, two on top. Yep. Um, yeah, just do the same. Two on top. So I'll play. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven cards. Uh, I'm going to mulligan. Okay. Uh, I will keep. Okay. This game was pretty unreal because I I destroyed like four of the lands as well as. 
That's what I was able to do. So the, the hand that I just uh, uh, shot back, it had um, a disenchant, a lotus, and it had a uh, um, a mistress factory and three birds of paradise. So I wasn't doing anything with that hand. Like I could have dropped all three birds, um, <laughs> and then had been able to disenchant something, but. Like, I mean, I wasn't, that, that hand just wasn't doing anything. It's like, I mean, I'd have all kinds of mana, but if you play something like balance, or th then I'm totally screwed, so. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, two on top. Two on top, okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I will keep this one. And uh, I'll put that one that back. Yep. And I will play a tropical island and a mox jet, and I'll say go. I'll play a library and boss. Draw. Sapphire, Tundra, Whoa. Mind Twist for three. Uh, I'll uh, draw a card. Yep. We got eight cards there. So uh, why don't you just... Uh, Get rid of uh, the three cards that are closest uh, to your deck. This three? Yep, those three can go away. Disenchant, Disenchant, and <laughs> Divine Offering. Oh, okay. Uh, go ahead. Go. Three. Underground, C, and pass. Untap. Draw. I'm going to test on myself. Yeah, yep. One, two, three. Um, I'm going to strip your library. And I will play a pearl mm -hmm. and a soul ring. And sure. I will say go. Play a swamp. Mm -hmm. um, dark ritual. Yep. An hypnotic. Okay. And pass. Uh, end step. Swords of Plowshares on the Spectre. Yep. Exile him. You gain two. Brings you up to 22. Untap. Draw. Birds of Paradise. Sure. Um, go ahead. Nice. Yep. And go. Untap. Draw. One, two, three, four. Armageddon. Hmm. Yeah, that's good. Um, I'm going to attack you for zero with my Birds of Paradise. I'll um, take it. <laughs> and then I will uh, drop a factory and I'll say go. So won't go. Untap. Draw. Uh, activate the factory and attack for two. 20. Okay. Uh, Serendip of Sure. Go ahead. Plus. Untap. Upkeep. I take a point. I'm at 19. Draw. Uh, activate my factory. Attack for 5. 15. And uh, I'll say go. <laughs> Plus. Untap. Upkeep, I take a point, down to 18. Draw. You have how many cards? 
I have uh, five. Five. Okay. I will activate the factory and I will attack for five. Ten. Uh, black vice. Sure. Um, and you can go. Uh, take one. You take one. You got nine. <sighs> I'll pass. Untap. Upkeep. I take one. I'm at 17. Draw. I will activate my factory and I'll attack for five. Yep. Four. And you have six cards now? Six cards. Uh, play another vice. Okay, I'm good. Wow. Wow. So that uh, that uh, uh, Geddon was uh, pretty brutal. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah. Is, I, but, I mean, um... I was uh, um, I was hoping you weren't going to make me discard the Geddon in uh, um, the previous game. Um, I just I didn't want you to see that I had it. So, uh, um, but uh, there's nothing I was there's there was no point in me casting the Armageddon at any point in time during uh, game number two. So uh, um, I, I didn't want to. Uh, but uh, whew, wow. Well, uh, Eric, thank you very much for the games. I appreciate it. Uh, thank you for allowing me to uh, uh, stream these once again. And uh, good luck with uh, your. The rest of your derby matches, okay, man? Yeah, thanks. It was uh, fun. So, uh, good luck, rest of the batch, on the next batch. Thank you. I appreciate it. Take care, man. Bye. Yeah, you too. All right, everybody. Well, uh, that uh, about wraps it up. So, uh, please, if you haven't already, don't forget to follow. Um, join me each and every Tuesday. Um, at 8 p.m. Eastern for my regularly scheduled stream, I stream three rounds of Old School Magic with the Northern Paladins as part of the Tuesday Night Gauntlet. Um, so coming up uh, tomorrow at 3 p.m. is my next stream. I'll be playing my next Winter Derby match. And then Sunday at 10 a.m. Eastern. Uh, see, uh, part 319, you shouldn't have stepped away. Uh, <laughs> that's it. So um, I want to thank everybody for... Uh, um, sticking with me in joining uh, the stream today and uh, what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to sign off for for the night uh, and you guys all have a great day enjoy your uh, New Year's happy New Year to everybody and don't forget to watch Cobra Kai take care